Hi everyone, I'm Anthony Allen from Green Diamond Equipment. Winter's come early here in Nova Scotia. It's mid to late November. We're getting snow, so I have to get my mower deck off my X500, uh, get the chains and uh, snow plow and snow blower ready. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do a couple different uh, videos. First one will be how to remove the mowing deck on the X300, X500 series. Uh, this is the pre um, 2016 models so there's a little bit of a change uh, in the newer models but the principle is the same. The first thing we have to do is make sure you're uh, parked on a safe surface to do this uh, then we're going to rotate our anti-scalp wheels 90 degrees to make it easy to roll out And those will just snap into the existing hole there to lock them in place. So we'll do this on all four wheels. All right, once that's done, we're ready to lower the deck down. With the deck blocked in the up position, I'm going to turn my cutting height knob down to the number one setting. What that'll allow it to do is the deck to set right on the floor to take the weight off the hanger brackets. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm gonna lower my deck down to the ground. Uh, to do this, I'm just gonna push down on the lift pedal release the lock. That will lower the deck down to the floor. Now what I'm going to do is I'm pulling back on the pedal and we're going to lock it down with the lock mechanism here. That holds the linkage down and the deck down to the ground. Now that the deck is down on the ground, I'm going to release my belt tension with this rod on this particular model. It just swings out like that and releases the belt tension. I always move to the front next and take off my front hangers first. I find it easier to get at the uh, back hangers. So we're just going to take off our front hangers. Uh, these little snap pins. Easiest way to grab these, just grab that uh, angled piece and pull out and then it'll slide right out. So I'll show a close up on this side. Again, I just hook my finger in under this angled piece, pull out, and it comes right off. So then I just release the tension there, and that front hanger comes right off. Okay, so now we're looking at the, the side of the deck here, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna release these U-bolts. Uh, They're spring-loaded from the lift arms. So all we do, pull out on that U-bolt, and lift that arm up and that side is free and we'll repeat on the other side we're on the other side now so again I'm just gonna repeat what I did the, that side load in my u-bolt and lift up on that uh, lift arm and uh, now that linkage is loose and hanging here and my deck is actually free from the tractor uh, other than removing the belt, which we'll do next. What I'm showing is the bottom view of the uh, PTO pulley. So I'm just gonna reach my hand in here underneath and all the tension's off the belt now so it just slips right off the PTO and uh, we're ready to roll the deck out from underneath the tractor. Now that everything's unhooked from my tractor, I'm gonna go back now and unlock my lift linkage so it lifts up out of the way so I can roll my deck out. Um, so what I'm going to do, pull back to my pedal, release my lock. Now this one has the spring assist lift on it so it's going to spring back a little bit and in the uh, up position I'm going to lock it again that way nothing moves and we're ready to roll the deck out. 
All right, now that we're ready to roll the deck out, first thing I'm going to do is I am just going to put my belt tension back into place, so that's out of the way. I am going to crank my wheels away from the side. I'm going to take the, take the deck out. And now it's just a matter of rolling this out. You may have to just fiddle around with it just to get it out past the wheels. And that's how easy it is to take the deck off of the X-Series tractors. Uh, filming, it took me probably about five to ten minutes at the most. If I were to do this without filming, we should be able to do it in about a minute or two. All right, I'm now deckless on my X500. So next step for me is to uh, get my deck cleaned up for the winter and get it ready for storage. Uh, I'll uh, show a segment on that. Uh, so check out the next video, subscribe to my channel to get updates. And I hope you learned how to get your deck off your tractor easily in this video. Thanks for watching.